Now let's talk about accenting the voice. How do I make accents? What's the correct way? Well, I just demonstrated before, you pull your abdomen inward and you breathe in your lower back. This is Caruso, Lily Lehman, uh, 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 Amelita Gallicurci, uh, Luisa Tetrazzini, all the greatest singers in history breathe by pulling the abdomen in and breathe in the, and breathe in the lower back. If I do that now, and I'm going to have to accent my voice. So I learn how to do staccati first. Breathe. Lean the breath. Ah, uh, ah, uh, and then do staccati. Ah, 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 You can sing that way on that little point. It's called the punta de poncho, the point of leaning. So I breathe, and I go. Ah, 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 ah. La donna è mia, It's easy. Now, what if I want to accent? I mustn't accent in a way that the breath ever comes up on my throat. So I direct my breath against the, the punta da poncho, and I do it with an accent. In Italian, they call those hard staccati, martellati, hammered notes. So I breathe in and go, So if I have an accent to make, La 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 la. Nothing comes up. Everything goes against my diaphragm. So I go, and I'm absolutely doing martellare. Just means to drum and to hit, right? So if I hit this note, ah, I hit it down here, and this is totally in in its reactionary state. It doesn't do any work. So I go, if I want to accent, I do it on my diaphragm, and before I sing, I take a breath behind me, and I lean my breath in front of me, on my diaphragm, and I breathe, suck it down, or do it silently, small, I'd hate to sing it that way. It's very unmusical. But if the point here is to demonstrate an accent, that's the way you would do it. And it's not hard. You'll, get, you'll find as we go along, everything is possible if the breathing is correct. And we must breathe in. Way down the lower back, we must lean the breath forward on the diaphragm. <laughs> Lily Lemon called that a breath stop, because if I don't stop it, he goes, ah, and it runs out of my throat, or through my throat. So I stop it. And I stop it right here. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, Tito Skipa said, sigh all the time. Oh, but you sigh downward into the diaphragm, so I go, Ah, 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 so everything's still loose, and I can still make my accent. Ah, 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 right? When you have dramatic music to sing, and you want to hit a big note, you hit it here, not in the throat. I'm shit, but he's made a father. You know, I didn't like singing that kind of music very much, but I sang it a lot, and I'm 78 years old this year and I can still sing. So the punishment is never on the throat or on the vocal cords or anywhere up here at all. The punishment, if you want to call exercise that, sometimes no, no, no pain, no gain, the, the, the hard work in singing has to do with, with breathing. Caruso said to squeeze your lower back like a bellows and put the pressure of the breath against your uh, against the front, against your diaphragm. Pavarotti said, it's here like a baby. Push, 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 right? A lot of singers, what's his keeper said, a sigh there. Ah, oh, ah. Oh. So we find all these people talking about uh, activating the breath in a way where it goes in down the back and goes out down the front. Breathe in and go, ah, 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 ah. Ah, uh, 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 ah, 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 
if you do it at all, and sometimes you try not to do them at all, but if you have to do one and the conductor is insisting that you, that you accent a note, then you make sure that it is a reinforced, intense, intensified staccato. I go, and those are called martellati. Okay? Try it. And keep it away from here. Bye.